What's up guys? Welcome back to the Educated Barfly. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a cobbler. Now the cobbler is a very old cocktail that dates back to the 1820s. We think. Actually, the guy that's credited with finding the first ever recorded um, recipe or mention of this cocktail was uh, Dave Wondrich. And he was has, I guess, uncovered a letter that was written uh, in 1838, I believe, by a woman named Catherine Jane Ellis, who was a Canadian traveling through the United States and gave an account in her diary of this drink. Um, that's a lot that we know about it. Other than that, in the late 1800s, it was really, really popular. Um, and actually, it gave rise to the cobbler shaker, which is that little kind of pill-shaped shaker with a removable top that's really popular in Japan. And also, dried macaroni, I'm assuming they made it longer back in the day, was used to sip this cocktail because it is made with crushed ice, and so we had to sip it, and that's how the straw was born, which is kind of interesting. Um, other than that, it's pretty damn good cocktail for this summer weather, and it was since we're kind of closing up the summer, but it's still really hot here in LA, I thought that I would teach it to you. So the first thing we are gonna do, you know what, we're not gonna start with gin. The first thing we're gonna do is take our ingredients. We've got one orange wedge, one lime wedge, a cherry that I pitted, so you need to use a cherry pitter to pit it, or you can, you know, you can, I guess you can do it with a pit on. I mean, we're gonna strain it anyway, so it does, I guess it doesn't really matter, but I pitted it, and one strawberry. Then we're gonna do an ounce of curacao, one and a half ounces of gin, I'm just going to give it a light muddle. We want to kind of press it, but not like shred it, basically. And today we've got the good pellet ice from this lovely comfrey company, Nev. So we're just going to like put it in our little bit into our shaker. We're going to lock our tins and just going to give it like a light whip shake. it that's about it just want to like add that dilution a little bit and then we're going to strain it this one's a crushed ice cocktail so you don't actually need to double strain I'm just gonna strain it into our glass and then we're gonna add our crushed ice And basically what this cocktail is intended to be is just a light punch to drink as a before dinner cocktail, I guess. There we go. I just want to clean up this excess ice. Toss it there. And there you have it, my friends. The cobbler. All right, let's taste this bad boy and see what it tastes like. Oh yeah, it tastes like punch. Yeah, it tastes like an amazing, I mean, it's just fresh fruit flavors, gin, a little curacao to sort of dry it out, but kind of balance those kind of sugary fruits. I'd crush it all day long. Mm hmm Yeah. I mean, everyone's going to like this. Not one of you is going to not like this. Just Literally, just make this cocktail now. Just stop what you're doing. Put it on pause. Rewind it. Figure out how to make the cocktail again. And just make it. That's what you should do. That's, I, think, I think I'm just going to go make another one.